so much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! It's me, Blippi, and look at where I am. Today, I'm at the Peterson Automotive Museum in Los Angeles, California. And in this museum, they have a lot of cars. They have old cars, new cars, and they might even have some fast cars. Cool. And I heard that actually we get to go down into the vault and see some really special cars. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa! There's so many cool cars here! Whoa! Look at this! Whoa! This one's really big. Do you see what it says? Police Patrol! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this. This isn't a car. This looks like a motorcycle. And it looks like a motorcycle for space! And Mars. Here we come! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh! Hey! Who are you? My name's Jason. Oh, nice to meet you, Jason. I'm Blippi. Nice to meet you, Blippi. <laughs> what kind of car is this? This is actually a hydrogen car. Hydrogen? Wait a second. Most cars run on gas, diesel, or electricity. What do you mean by hydrogen? Well, it runs on hydrogen just like you find in the air. Oh, so you put in hydrogen in this car, then what comes out of the exhaust pipe? Well, the hydrogen that you put in the tank combines with air it's getting through the front grill, the oxygen in the air mixes with the hydrogen to form water. Whoa, cool. So H2O, two hydrogen and one oxygen combined. Yeah, makes water. So cool. <laughs> Speaking of cool, why does it look so cool? Well, unlike most cars that come to you painted, this car you get to paint yourself. Whoa. And I have some markers for you to do that with. Oh, cool. So like he says, Normal vehicles, you cannot paint or draw or decorate at all. But this vehicle, he says, I and you get to decorate. So cool. Whoa. Can I decorate it? Of course you can. All Have right. fun, Blippi. All right. Thank you. <laughs> wow, this is going to be so much fun. Where should we start? Hmm, let's see. Um, about right here. <laughs> here we go. Take some orange, color in those circles. Oh, cool. <laughs> All right, how about some blue? Oh, there we go. Nice little chimney. Oh, what about right there? <laughs> there we go. Looks like the car is complete. Wow, what a cool looking car now. And it's so colorful. Whoa. <laughs> Sure do love this car. <laughs> Wait a second, do you see that way over there? A blue car, and it looks like someone's working on it. Let's go say hi. <laughs> Whoa, hey, who are you? I'm Brad. Oh, nice to meet you, Brad. I'm Blippi. What are you doing here? We're just getting this car ready for the Cinco de Mayo show. Whoa, a car show? Car shows are so cool. All the cars line up, and then all these people walk around and check out the really cool cars. Whoa, how big is this engine? 327. Wow, how many cylinders does it have? Six cylinders. Six cylinders. Are they all in a line or an inline six or is it a V6? This is a V6. Whoa, cool. So three cylinders on this side, three on this side, and then it looks like the letter V. Cool. Have you added oil to it yet? Not yet. We're just getting ready to now. Cool. Can we check it together? Yes, sir. Whoa, cool. Whoa, there it is. Oh, looks like the oil is nice and full. Cool. Hey, Brad, what's this plastic here for? This is to protect the car to make sure we don't scratch it or get it dirty. Oh, that's very smart. Hey, do you mind if we check out the inside of the car? No problem. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so excited. I wonder what it looks like. <laughs> Whoa, wait a second. Do you see there's no door handles? Huh, Brad, how do you get inside? You lower the windows with a key fob, and okay. then you reach inside and there's a handle inside. Oh, cool. So when the window is down, then you can open up the door. Oh, check it out. Whoa. 
Wow, that's a cool looking inside. <laughs> do you mind if I sit inside? Please do. Whoa, all right, here I go. <laughs> Whoa, it's a really tight squeeze in here. Do you see how short the roof is? Yeah, it used to be taller, but then they shortened it. Whoa, and the inside is blue and white. Blue is one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> you knew that already. Whoa, and look at the steering wheel. It's so shiny. Me, me, me. Whoa, and all these gauges and gadgets and levers. Whoa, the car looks pretty old. I wonder how old this car is. Hey, let me ask Brad. <laughs> That is a really cool car, Brad. How old is this car? That's a 1937. Wait a second. Is that 85 years old? 85 years old. Whoa, 85 years old to this date right now. Now that is a really old car. Do you have any other old cars? Sure, we have a 1957 Chevy right over here. Can we see? Yes, sir. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, what kind of car is this, Brad? This is a 1957 Chevrolet Bel Air convertible. Cool! Do you see the color? It's the color green! Whoa! And like Brad said, it's a convertible. Do you see how there's no roof? Yeah, so then you can drive along and have the wind blowing your hair. So cool! Woo! And what's so unique about this car? What I think is unique about this car are the wings. The wings? Is that this? Yeah. Wow, cool! One of the neat things about the wings are if you open this up, this is where you put the fuel in. Whoa, do you see that? Yeah, that's where you put the fuel in. In most cars, you put it in on the side. Cool. Whoa, speaking of cool, what's this giant circle? That's the spare tire. Oh, that's really practical. So then, if you ever get a flat tire, you have a spare tire. Cool. <gasps> Whoa, speaking of cool, what kind of car is this, Brad? This is a 1910 Model T. Whoa, a 1910 Model T. Oh yeah, that's done by Ford. This is a really old car. Is this the first kind of car in America? This is one of the first cars built in America. Wow, cool. And uh, how do you start it? Is there a key? There's no key for this car, Blippi. This car, you turn this handle right here on, crank it over, and that's how you start it. Whoa, do you see this handle? Brad said you crank it and turn it, and then that's how the car starts. Awesome! <laughs> do you mind if I sit inside? Please do, Blippi. Cool! All right. Whoa! Whoa! Now this car is really old! Whoa! Look at me! I'm driving in history! <laughs> cool! Was this car really fast, Brad? No, this car was very slow. Oh, so it's old and slow. Do you have any old and fast cars? Yeah, right here. We have a 1947 Indy car. Cool! Oh, let's go check it out. Whoa, yeah, whoa, what a cool race car. What kind of car is this, Brad? This is a 1946 Ross Page Special. Wow, a really old race car. That is so cool. Did it go super fast? It went about 125 miles per hour. Wow, that is fast. That's about 200 kilometers an hour. Whoa, and look down here. Whoa, it even has a seat belt. Whoa, a very old looking seat belt. <laughs> yeah, and what's this right here, Brad? That's the gear shift, shift lever. Oh, so how many gears does this car have? Only one gear in this car, Blippi. Only one gear? Yeah, normal cars these days have many, many gears. Yeah, five, six, right around there. And that's why they sound like ring, ring, ring. Cool. Whoa, do you mind if I take it for a spin? Take it for a spin, good luck. All right, here we go. Let's start the race in three, two, one. Whoa, yeah, this car is fast. Whoa, look at the crowd. Hey crowd, whoa. Ooh, and the flagger, yeah. They tell me what lap I'm on, so cool. Whoa, whoa, it's a lot of old cars. Wow, cool. Hey, wait a second. Whoa, maybe we can find the oldest car here. Let's go, whoa! Whoa, check it out. This is a Ford Model A. And this looks like a very old vehicle. Wow, it doesn't even look like a car because it looks really big. 
Hey, this is a station wagon. Ooh, and do you see the doors? Yeah, they look like they're made of wood. And I actually got permission to open it up. So, should I open it up? Yeah! Hello! Wow! So old! Wow! I wonder if we can find another old car. Maybe an even older one. Yeah! Whoa! Cool! Another really old car. This is actually a 1918 Model T. Wow, so old! And just like the other car, I got permission to open the door. <laughs> Whoa, check it out! Wow, now that is an old car. And check this out down here. Whoa, do you see this? Do you know what this is? Yeah, a toolbox. Whoa! <laughs> Yeah, you can put your screwdriver in there, pair of pliers, even a wrench. Cool! Let's go see if we can find an even older car! <laughs> Whoa! Cool! Another really old car! Whoa! It's the color red, black, ooh, there's even some shiny gold! This is a 1903 Cadillac Model A. Whoa! I wonder where the engine is. Huh, I don't know, do you see it? <gasps> Wait a second. Maybe the engine is where the trunk normally is. I got permission to open it up. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, the engine. Now that is an old engine, cool. <laughs> wow, I love cars and I love old cars. I wonder if we can find an even older car, yeah. Check it out! Now this is an old car! Whoa! This car is so old! Actually, this car is from 1886. Yeah, it's actually one of the very first practical cars in the world! When it's so old, it doesn't even have a steering wheel. You see? Kind of looks like a steering lever. <laughs> cool! Ooh, and down here, wow! Yeah, the wheel and tire. Doesn't it kind of look like it's from a bicycle? <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> wow, and the seat looks pretty comfortable, I guess. Oh, and back here, this is the engine. So powerful. <laughs> Just kidding. This only could drive about 10 miles an hour. That's about 16 kilometers an hour. <laughs> and how you started it is with this flywheel. You would grab on and turn it and push it. It was really hard to start. Cool. Well, I had so much fun finding all these old cars with you. Good job. <laughs> wow, wasn't that so much fun? I know, it was. Wow, I really enjoyed learning about those really old cars. Oh, and those really old cars that were also super fast. Whoa. And you can't forget about that car that ran on hydrogen. Oh, so cool. I love decorating it. So colorful. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy. Good job. All right. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs>